Oh man! <laughs> this is the absolute. This is my new favorite episode of Red vs. Blue, and I scared my dog again. This is a truly fantastic episode, both from every standpoint. <laughs> so I just finished watching it now, and it is inc it is just a work of art, really. So, the Reds and the Blues finally talk, and they realize, thinking, okay, there has to be something we can do. These two sides, they have to be at peace. And they figure, so, okay, let's just have them, let's do something. But then they realize, hey, wait, wasn't there an alarm going just a minute ago? They go outside, everything's destroyed, everyone's dead. They get, they get in a jeep, and they, see, they hear a radio, it's just like, we're under attack. And then, we meet our attackers, they just kill everyone, except, you know, the Reds and the Blues. And we see Locus and his elite team of elite people. They're about to kill the Reds and the Blues, but then Felix intervenes, saves the day! Or does he? In fact, it seems that Felix and Locus had this really diabolical plan to, like, just murder, just, like, take a planet, like, destroy a planet or whatever. And that basically every little thing they did just would just made this war between the two sides even worse. And when they got the Reds and the Blues involved, it made the war even worse. I'm like, wow, <laughs> that's pretty evil. Um, and then a huge, epic battle ensues. When like, <laughs> okay, the fantastic reveal. Carolina comes back. I'm like, yeah, sweet. And then Church comes back. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Church is back! Finally! It took a season and a half, but he's finally back, and he's Carolina's AI, which is awesome. <laughs> the first thing Tucker does, he's like, you fuck! <laughs> Attempts to tackle him. Church doesn't have a body, he's still just an AI. But this was a great episode! Um, <laughs> just everything. I, I just The fights is great, it's nice and tense, it's nice seeing... Felix's true colors, I mean, I, this guy was an asshole, I, did, I never expected him to be like, you know, the villain. Uh, and they, we actually see where that, that warp cube, those like grenade cubes, takes him to some alternate place. Um, yeah, Carolina does that thing, her armor changes color. I first recognized her voice in her helmet, I'm like, that's Carolina, that's Carolina, oh man, <laughs> this is so exciting. <laughs> this is just a fantastic episode. Um, I'm excited for where it's going to uh, take the season because now we're officially at the halfway point of the season. So uh, it can, wherever it decides to go, that's up to them. But I'm excited to see where it's going to go. Uh, Felix and Locus will probably end up dead. I don't know. Um, <laughs> Church is back, which makes me so, so happy. <laughs> Carolina's back, which also makes me happy. Um, I, I, you know, she developed a lot in like season 10 but yeah just an overall fantastic fantastic episode it's my new favorite episode of the season i'm gonna watch this like a hundred times get it drilled into my brain yeah what did you think of, of episode 10 it was just truly fantastic um the setup the build-up and the re and the reveals both big reveals the only real gripe i had is that felix and carolina had this fight and it looked and it was Kind of lame. I mean, this is where, you know, this is where, you know, season 9 and season 10 really benefited from being an all CG episode, from all, an all CG seasons or whatever. The fights looked a lot better in those seasons. This, they don't look as good. They look a bit too, like, obviously CG. Um, in the sense that because uh, they're blending it in with in game stuff, it doesn't flow as well. And sometimes it looks. A bit too blocky and too simple. Um, but that's the only real gripe. I mean, the fight itself is fairly cool. I mean, Carolina gets stabbed in the leg. I was like, no! But yeah, now that Church is finally back in the show, because I've said this a thousand times before, the dumbest thing that Season 11 did was removing Church. Now that he's back, I'm excited and curious where the season's going to go. And uh, yeah, it does feel a bit on the slight needlessly complex like this sort of plan they have but you know it makes sense what they're doing so it's kind of neat what they're doing so yeah just a great episode nice this gets a nice 10 out of 10 from me and i'm really excited to see where the season's gonna go hopefully it 
we get another great episode. But until then, see you later. Bye.